The following video is presented by EA Game Changers. Early access to this content is provided by EA and Fire Monkeys. Gina's back! Gina from the underworld is back! Tyler and Kim have been abducted. We have to save them. We don't have a car faster to save them though. Well, we do. Actually. See, this is why Christian von Koenigsegg makes these things. To save people. Transporter here and welcome to an all new update for Need for Speed No Limit. Shout out to EA for helping me put this all, whole thing together because this one is a very significant update. For those of you who have been following the Need for Speed Underworld series, how we um, helped Gina with her conglomerate and eventually got to take home the McLaren P1 from her, she said she vowed to take us down again. And this is what we've come to now. This is Need for Speed Underworld Downfall the series finale of the two parts event um so she's getting back at us she's abducted tyler and kim we have to save them and to save them we're using the fastest car in the game which is a koenigsegg regera now in terms of rating it's not as high as rating as a venom gt but it still has the highest top speed out of any car in this game 520 kilometers per hour that is its top speed no nitrous <laughs> So that's one car. Now the other car in this game is a British car that is that shouldn't exist, doesn't exist, but um, in the, in movies and in video games it is real. It is a Jaguar CX-75, and I'm pretty sure that's the car that Gina will drive. I think at the end of the event of Need for Speed Underworld Downfall. Well, don't quote me on that. I'm just making speculation, but I have driven both cars, so I can tell you that they are here and they are fast. So, um. That will be available in the Proving Grounds event. So the first event will be available this Thursday. That is the Underworld Downfall event, which between the Koenigsegg and Gregera. Then two weeks after that, we have the... And a week after that... Two weeks after that? No, it's a week. No, two weeks after that. Yeah, two weeks after that, we have the Jaguar CX-75 for Proving Grounds. That Ivo will use... Ivo will give us, and we will do... They're both tiered events, so... They will have its own reward after certain certain days, and that will be that. So another news: there's also a new rap for Black Ridge Rivals. It's only one rap this time, not three raps like we did with last season with Steve Aoki. Only one rap this time, and as usual, they have um, blueprints at the end for any cars that you haven't staged up yet. So that's that. Um, this also comes with its own car series, which you can use either the Regero or the CX-75, but you can finish the whole thing with the CX-75. Now, speculation again, I think we'll be able to max out the CX-75 at the end of Proving Grounds. The Regera, obviously not because that would be unfair, but the CX-75 will be able to because it's not as high rated. It's nearly as high, it's about similar to the um, Pagani Zanda Cinque. So, and we were able to max that car out when we, once we got it. So, I think we'll be able to max this one out once we get it um, because it's not like top tier Fat, top tier um, Black Ridge Rivals competitive like the CCX, the P1, the Centenar, the Venino and all that stuff. Or uh, the 1 to 1 and the Venom GT. So I think we'll be able to max it out. And we can use that max out car to um, finish um, that special event in um, the car series. So that's that. So that's pretty much it. Um, in this video, I'm going to showcase the Regera. I'll do about 13 events of the car series in the Regera. Then the next couple of events I'll do in SCX-75. And that will be it. So this update is now live on your iPhone or Android phone. So go to the Google Play Store or go to the iPhone App Store and update your app. And you'll be all set to go.